this is my bluetooth control car and in this video i'll show you how i build it with just few components so without further ado let's get started first i took an mda board and measured it according to my requirements After marking the dimensions, I cut it properly to make the base of my project. Next, I took 4 BO motors, so I attached them one by one to the MDF board. Once the motor were in place, I soldered wires to each of them. Before we jump back into the build, I want to give a big thanks to today's sponsor JLCMC. If you are into robotics, mechatronics or DIY projects like me, you know how hard it can be to find the right parts without spending too much or waiting forever for shipping. That's why I really like JLCMC. They have got a low prices, fast delivery and the option to order the custom parts made exactly the way you need them. It honestly makes prototyping and building so much easier. And here's something awesome, you get a $70 coupon just for signing up as a new user. That's a huge help when starting your next project. So definitely check it out jlcmc.com. I will also drop the link in the description below. Big thanks to jlcmc for supporting Maker Science and now let's get back to creating. After that, I took an 18650 battery holder and fixed it onto the board. Then I placed the L2980 motor driver and attached it as well. The next important component was Arduino. So I fixed it on the board using a hot glue. To turn the system on and off, I added a small switch and secured it in place. Following the circuit diagram, I soldered all the required connections. I also connected the motor wires to the motor driver as shown in the diagram. You can download the complete circuit diagram from the description. After that, I took HC05 Bluetooth module and soldered its 4 wires. Then 
then connected it with Arduino. I fixed it neatly on the MDF board as well. Finally, I soldered the switch connections. At this stage, all the wirings and connections were complete. Next, I attached four wheels to the motors and car structure was almost ready. Then I connected Arduino to my laptop. Open the Arduino IDE. Then selected the correct board and port. Uploaded the code. We can also download the complete code from the description below. Finally, I inserted three fully charged 1862 batteries onto the holder, and just like that, my Bluetooth controlled car was completely ready. To control the car, I downloaded an Android app from Play Store. Paired it with HC05 Bluetooth module. and then connected it through the app and as you can see the car was working perfectly fine so what do you think pretty cool right if you enjoyed this project and learned something new make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to maker science for more awesome diy builds and don't forget to check out the circuit diagram and full code links are in the description below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next project. Until then, keep making, keep exploring.